Hello and welcome to this channel. Viewers, it has been a while since I uploaded any video. But not to worry, I was caught up with many things. In today's presentation, we are going to look at this particular question. 3 to the power x over 1 plus 3 to the power x is equal to 2 over 5. Right? Then, what will be the value of 81 to the power x over 1 plus 81 to the power x? This is an Olympiad question. Before we proceed, make sure you click on the subscribe button, like and share. Now, let's look at the solution. We have 3 to the power x over 1 plus 3 to the power x equal to 2 over 5. Now let's let a be equal to 3 to the power x. Alright, and then that changes our expression to a over 1 plus a is equal to 2 over 5. That is basically a linear equation. Let's solve for the value of a. Now when you cross multiply, you have 5a is equal to 2 brackets open 1 plus a bracket close. When we expand the right hand side, we have 5a is equal to 2 plus 2a. Alright, and then grouping like terms, we have 5a minus 2a is equal to 2. Now that simplifies to 3a is equal to 2. Now dividing both sides by 3, we come up with the value a is equal to 2 over 3. Right, that's the first part of it. But don't forget that 3 to the power x is equal to a as seen here. Alright, now let's look at the expression. Let's look at how we can manipulate this to look somehow like this so that we can have a connection between the two. Now, um, that will also now imply that 3 to the power x is equal to 2 over 3. Since 3 to the power x is equal to a and we had a to be 2 over 3. Now, 81 to the power x over 1 plus 81 to the power x is equal to you see that we can express 81 as 3 to the power 4, all to the power x. Alright? And of course, we can also express, do the same thing down here, so that we now have 1 plus 3 to the power 4, all to the power x. Okay? When we simplify, you get to realize that, or applying the law of indices, that says that when a power is raised to a power, multiply the exponent. We come up with the expression 3 to the power 4x over 1 plus 3 to the power 4x. Now let's do some little bit of manipulation. This can also be rewritten as 3 to the power x all to the power 4. Okay? Over 1 plus 3 to the power x all to the power 4. Still applying the same law of indices that says that when the power is raised to a power, multiply the exponents. If you multiply x by 4, you still come back to the same thing. Alright? So we are just rewriting it in a way that relates to this question. Now, but we got a value of 3 to the power x to be equal to 2 over 3. When we substitute 3 to the power x is equal to 2 over 3 into the expression, we now have 2 over 3 all to the power 4 over 1 plus 2 over 3 all to the power 4. Okay? Applying the laws of indices, we come up with the expression 2 to the power 4 over 3 to the power 4 all over 1 plus 2 to the power 4 over 3 to the power 4. Now, doing some little bit of manipulation, we can go further and simplify that this is the same as 16 over 81 all over 1 plus 16 over 81. Now, this one here can easily be written as 81 over 81 so that we have a common denominator. That way, we can easily resolve that particular fraction expression by adding the numerators. Okay, so let's do that. So, you now have 16 over 81. Uh, over 81 over 81 plus 16 over 81. Now, when you add the numerators here, that's 81 plus 16, you're now going to have 16 over 81 over 97 over 81. Now, this is just the same as writing it as 16 over 81 divided by 97 over 81. Do you get that? Now, when we apply the rule of dividing fractions, we change the division sign to times and then we take the reciprocal of this particular expression. And that now gives us 16 over 81 times 81 over 97. Now, realize that 81 divides out 81 and that results to the expression 16 over 97. So we can therefore say that 81 to the power x 
all over 1 plus 800 to the power x is equal to 16 over 97. I hope this was quite comprehensive. Thank you for your time. Make sure you click on the subscribe button, like and share. Goodbye.